What's going on guys? Shane here. I'm joined by a couple of members who have competed in the IFMA, which is one of the highest level of Muay Thai competition. We've got Janet Todd and Gianna Smith, also joined by Jackie Buntan. We're going to be talking about the clinch today, how to use it against an aggressive opponent, how to initiate, and how to stop the clinch. Let's take a look. So this is one of the many ways I like to initiate the clinch in the fight. Um, right now we're not really in clenching distance, so I like to close the distance by throwing a cross, which is unexpected since most people like to close the distance with a jab. So instead of the jab, we'll start off with the cross. So when you cross, you take a step with your other foot, make sure that that foot is on the outside of your opponent's foot. You need to make sure that you have a hold of either a head or an arm to know that you're close enough. Otherwise, if you're here and you try to knee, you're totally gonna miss them. So it's important that you have that connection. So after you throw the cross, make a connection so you're close enough and then throw the knee. And after you're done with the knee, bring your head in close for that clinch position. For me, I really don't like this. This is a bad position for me. So I'm gonna adjust my feet and then throw my arm across her face. And then I'm gonna push my second hand right on top. Uh, the best position I feel like is to reach for the chin because that's gonna make her turn sideways. And from here, I can knee, I can dump her. There's a lot I can do. A second option, <clears throat> would be to swing my arms to the inside to gain better control. And then from here, again, I can sweep, I can turn, and knee. There's a lot I can do, but I have a better position than where I was at before. Now let's talk about a way to prevent a pressure fighter from the clinch. You want to close the distance, block the cross, and you're going to use your full shin against your hips to block any attacks coming, specifically knees. An important factor is to keep your foot hooked onto your opponent so they can't move, they can't really move at all. And another important factor is control their hands so they can't come forward, they can't really do anything to me. You're basically in control. And another way you can use it is while you're in the clinch. You can use the same technique, cross block, foot is hooked, arms are in control. And another way to counterattack this is to just simply put your lead leg down and knee. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Just to close this video, we want to give a couple of shout outs. I'd like to thank everybody from Five Points Academy, Brian Popejoy of Boxing Works, West Coast Muay Thai, most importantly, USMF, USMF. and last but not least, In Fight Style. Cool. Guys, uh, there's a link in the description below to donate to the USMF. Brian, could you touch on that a little bit? Absolutely. Uh, this is the first year that uh, Muay Thai has uh, obtained provisional uh, Olympic recognition. Um, so what we're really hoping for is Muay Thai to become an Olympic sport. Um, many countries throughout the world have fully sponsored amateur athletes. Their training's paid for. Um, their flights, their accommodation taken care of by the government. They're basically subsidized for the, uh, by their government to train and compete in Muay Thai. The United States, we don't have that benefit. Our athletes have to bear the brunt of the expenses for travel to these uh, international events. Um, and it can be quite costly for an amateur athlete. So any donation uh, made to the USMF will help to grow and support uh, Muay Thai, amateur Muay Thai in the United States. Um, and help our athletes uh, offset their, their expenses, their costs, uh, to be able to compete on the world stage. So we thank you very much for that. Thank you. Awesome. Again, guys, the link is in the description below. Any donation will, is uh, much appreciated. Until next time, I'm Shane with Fight Tips for the Underdogs. <laughs> <laughs>